everybody. This is Justin from KQS, and we're back! Yay! So we are, uh, we, as you can see, we got our final two health upgrades. You really didn't miss much. We fought a bunch of, uh, just generic monsters. So, it's time to fight the D, uh, the, uh, Mutant Lord round two. So let's skip that. Galaxy Master. The Underworld Lord. So, uh, same thing applies. Nothing has changed. Always go underneath his... his, uh... his weak hand, I guess you could say. See? Not hard. Yay! <laughs> now comes the real fun. And as you can see, we got a new cutscene. It's no use. I can't get the transmission working. Please be safe, Jason. Huh? What's this? Some kind of mutant. The same as the mutant lord. No. It's even stronger. No way. This can't be happening. The sheer power of this thing is overwhelming. Not to mention its new form. This is the mutant lord's true form, the one that possesses intelligence. Even if it is, I can't lose now. I gotta protect the earth and Eve. All right. So first things first. Let's, uh... Ah, shit. Uh... Okay. I think... Max damage. There we go. See? No problem. Okay, good, because I gotta I just don't remember the, any of their weaknesses. Eve, can you hear me? Jason, yes, I can hear you. Thank goodness you're safe. Somehow, yeah, I got so worried when our comms went down, but it looks like you're all right too. That's a relief. Yeah, Sophia was a huge help. So is that the mutant lord? Yeah, somehow I was able to defeat it. I think I destroyed it. I think <clears throat> I, I saw it destroyed. Right before my eyes, so it's certain. So I certainly hope that's the end of it. Just in case, could you do a scan and make sure you don't pick up anything that resembles it? Just as I thought. Well then, Eve, something wrong? No, it's nothing. There's no trace of the mutant lord here anymore. I see. That means our battle with the mutants is over. Yeah, it sure is. You saved the planet, Jason. Not quite. We saved it. You, me, Fred, and Sophia, too. I never thought, or I never could have done it by myself. Heh <laughs> heh, I'm happy to hear you say that. But that was our mission. So that means... It looks like Sophia found a rope back to the surface, Jason. We can leave when you get back. I'll be waiting for you. Got it. I'm on my way now. It's beautiful. Yeah, it sure is. We were welcomed back to the surface by a night sky filled with countless glistening stars. Squall dots. More squall dots. Thank you for everything, Jason. I'm here now because you saved me. And were there for me. I just did what I thought was right. But I'm happy that meant I was able to help you out. 
Yeah, you've done more for me than I could ever ask for. Which is why I can't ask you to do any more than I already have. Eve? Suddenly I felt a warm, tender feeling. That was Eve hugging me tightly. Although it took a little while to fully understand why. Jason, I have to go so that I can protect yeah, so that I can protect you and this planet. Eve, what are you what, what? <laughs> It felt like the energy was being suddenly zapped from my body. My vision got all hazy. I could barely stand up. Cool, I got tased. What's going on? I don't understand. Don't worry. You'll only be unconscious for a little while. What are you talking about? Why? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just reading this pretty hilariously. Oh crap, I forgot to turn off my emails. Give me a sec. Quit. Okay. All right. <laughs> Everything quickly grew dim. My body was so warm, and before I knew it, I completely lost consciousness. Sorry, I'm being a total professional. I silenced my phone, but not my email. <clears throat> On my Mac. The last thing I saw was that, for the first time, Eve looked like she was about to cry. I'm so sorry. I knew you would have helped me if I asked, I'm sure of that. But this mutant core, you know nothing about it. And never even come face to face with it. Based on readings I have, I can't guarantee that even Sophia, being fully powered up like this, will even stand a chance against it. I couldn't bear the thought of dragging you into battle against something that dangerous. I know I'm being, being completely selfish, but this is something I must do. I'm heading out, Jason. <laughs> Where? What happened? Oh no! Eve! I remembered her words that she was going to save the planet and me. Not to mention, she looks so sad. Even just remembering it makes my heart ache. I looked around and saw Sophia was gone too. I tried to contact them, but it was no use. The connection was totally shot. That's when I remembered something she told me. She said that there was a certain thing here on Earth that had to be destroyed. Ribbit, ribbit. Fred? Looks like Eve left you here, too. Croak. <laughs> what should I do, buddy? Is there really nothing I can do? Croak. As if he was telling me to follow him, Fred looked over at me and began to hop off somewhere. Where are you going? I followed after him and noticed that he went to the same place where we fell down the wormhole when I was chasing him a while back. Fred? What are you- Brrr, Frog noise. Fred opened his mouth and suddenly the area started be around us began to tremble. What? Hey, hey, what's going on? The area began to tremble even more. Then, a strange hole appeared out of nowhere right in front of me. No way. Is this- Is this a wormhole? Indeed, one of Fred's abilities is to create these- so that he has a direct path to be able to return to Sophia. The wormhole kept on expanding. The moment when the wormhole expanded to its maximum size, it began to come into view. I kind of wish they actually had a cutscene for this, or like a, like, an actual normal, like, picture. This is... Aha! So it's another Sophia. It looks like Sophia, but something is different. I got close to it and the cockpit opened up. Fred and I hopped in. This one's called Sophia Zero. So it's some kind of updated version. Its abilities and weaponry seem more powerful than Sophia Thirds. At its core though, it seems to be just a, or it seems to be the same as Sophia Third. So in that case, 
If I just take out my blaster rifle. Blaster rifle authentication complete. Nah, robot noise. Switching from autopilot to manual operation. <laughs> All right, here we go. Huh? What's this? A message? Squall dots. I see. So that's how it is. All right, I know what I have to do. Fred, can you can you open another wormhole and get me to where Sophia and Eve are located? We have no time to waste. Croak. I'm counting on yeah, counting on you, buddy. Eve, please be safe. So now we are in the final area. What is this place? I emerged from the wormhole and into this strange space that was an amalgamation of a bunch of different things. Am I still on Earth? Or some or somewhere completely different? Regardless of where I've ended up, I need to look for Eve and Sophia. So, we got the Sophia Zero. When she when she runs around, she's got this really cool after image. So, uh, I think she actually is a little bit more powerful. Let me test. Yeah. Hey, look at this. <laughs> ah, shoot, I... Nope, I shouldn't have done that. See, I don't even have to charge anything anymore. I can just simply... And even the explosions are larger. Alright, I shouldn't have <laughs> gone too crazy with that. Is definitely more powerful. Let's see. There we go. I prefer the laser, to be honest. And this guy. It's like, hey, what's up? Like, literally the late, like... He is no match for everything we throw at him this time. So the cool thing is... So the one thing that kind of made me... Or freaked me out, to be honest, because we're in water now. And, like, it was just really... It's just really weird. Like, if you... It took me a second to actually realize it. of all this stuff before I start well most of it as much as I can because this part sucks anything that involves Jason kind of sucks actually I'm trying to think if we have a map yes we do actually have a map this time Here we go. That's a relief. Uh, let's see what we got. Big maze. Somehow we'll get through there. 
But this is the part where it just starts starts becoming like a big boss rush. Which is not bad. There we go. This is going to be tough. Yep. <laughs> Absolutely a boss rush. And don't mistake in the other mother brain. There we go. Don't mistake in that mother brain with the Metroid mother brain. Okay. Got something a little bit better. <laughs> That's just great. Mother brains. Yes, that turret is extremely helpful. Fine. Okay, now I'm full powered. Yay, we actually have a real map. says absolutely nothing. We'll find out once we get out. But that is a good start. Once we have a having an actual map helps immensely. Oh see look at all these these rooms. There's multiple rooms you just have to go through. It's pretty nuts. Yeah. I really hate when those happen. Cause like I, I I really hate like force damage. It's always like the worst thing. Mm, come on. There we go. Let's recover a little bit of that health. So I gotta remember I can go through the purple stuff. Uh, okay, good. I'm out of here. I'm coming back to beat you up. Come on. Sophia, do your crazy magic stuff. Alright, let's fly to the corners. Alrighty. Max power. Ah, this guy. Or these guys. They just have more health. Too hard. Just 
double. I think they have double. The, I'm not even sure their health values in this game, but it is much more than what it usually is. Oh, this guy's fun. <sighs> even though this isn't really. 100% the optimal way. I actually like, I think the optimal way of doing it is actually kind of cool. Ugh, mash! Think about that. Oh no! Come on, let me grab the thing. Actually, okay. I am full on stuff. Yeah, this is where it gets fun. <laughs> So this is where you can essentially be invincible. Always take care of the bottoms first. those lasers. <laughs> this makes it so easy. It's like, oh no, it's intensifying. But that doesn't really matter just because the fact that like you you literally control like if you, if you didn't if you didn't if you couldn't freeze the floor this game would be this part would be so much more difficult just hold it down oh one of them dies eventually Die already! It's only just the two of you left. There we go. Simple! More keys. It's 
go to the one on the bottom. I kind of feel that that... Actually, let's see where that sends me. Yep. So it just kind of sends you to the adjacent one. Ow. That was my bad. I did not... I was not paying attention. It was like, oh, mines. I didn't see it until the very last moment. Man, just chill. Okay. Where in the world am I? Fred's wormhole brought me here, though, so that means that there's no doubt that... Even Sophia must be here somewhere. Keep it together. I know how I'm gonna. F I know how I'm gonna find even Sophia. Now, just to make sure that I didn't overlook anything. Okay. Oh, okay. That's how it works. This is normal gravity. And that's... So yeah, this is normal gravity, and the purple stuff is uh, water, underwater gravity. Actually, yeah, we'll just cling to the wall. Screw that. Doesn't. Oh, it does lead somewhere. Hmm. Let's try this. She not gonna switch my laser. Some kind of door ish thing. Interesting. Hmm. I'll come back to that later. Whoop. Hmm. That one's actually pretty interesting. in some parts. Jeez. I hate those things. kill myself here. I'm like, do I need to... Oh, I hate this stupid stuff. Okay. Oh, that's gonna be hard. 